Hello everyone, good day, good morning, honestly, good morning, how's everybody? Got my new wig, it's not exactly as long as I thought it was gonna be. I got one side pull, pulled up, but I'm just saying, it's not as long as I thought, but it's actually quite pretty. It really is, it's really cute. Um, it looks more realer, I just got on a hat because it looks good with my outfit and plus I don't want too much sun because I'm about to do some skincare I got my skincare the other day so I'm gonna be putting that on so I don't want to get too much direct sunlight on my face because I'm about to use this new skincare you guys which is gonna be amazing it's like a detoxing uh, skincare stick and it just cleans out your pores and when it does that you have the most beautiful clear complexion i can't wait to try i haven't tried it yet but i can't wait i'm going to um i figured okay this is a little bit too too much tmi but i was gonna use it today i wasn't gonna put on any makeup but i came on my period so I know some people say, so what? You can still do, I still clean my face. I just want to wait till after my period's done because you know how sometimes when you're on your period, you still have little, like little breakouts. So I'd rather just wait till I'm done and then go in and detoxify my pores and get a lot. I know I got a lot. I can see it. Like, when I take off my makeup, my skin is clean, but I've got so many area areas. That's what they were showing. Like a lot of that, you just need to detoxify your pores. Your pores are so clogged with just, I guess years and years of just stuff being in it or whatever, whatever you put, the environment, whatever, anything. For me, I know that there was a lot of criminal activity in my home, and I know some things were put in my foundations that caused a lot of this problem that I have. Now, some of it is from the sun, because I did, you know, really, I was out in the sun a lot when I was younger, but a lot of it came from that, also, that criminal activity. But I'm just, just, going on beyond that i'm excited to try this detoxifying stick smooth out my skin and have a pretty canvas okay so yeah i'm excited about that i really am i'm really excited about it and i can't wait i can't wait to try it um so they're all wrapped up real good and everything and you just literally put that stick on your skin and then you rub it off oh my god a lot of y'all gonna know y'all probably might have used it yourself um but it's really nice uh skin care that detoxify i really want to get that um it's a stomach patch that they have too and they say it detoxify what's in the inside and you can lose weight because it takes out all the toxins out of of the i guess the stomach area and then they y'all know that they have the kind that you put on your feet you know you just put it on your feet they look like pads you know when people take it off it's all black and and yucky looking okay they had those too that you could just use those if you wanted to and people said that they get good results by that too but i don't know i don't know about that because i just i would like to try the stomach one i would like to just see what it would do for me uh but first i'm gonna try this max stick because i have not done anything related to detoxifying except for that black detoxifying mask i've used it my skin looked beautiful i used it about 
uh, two years ago. And then I do get some of the generic forms of that mask, but it's not like the original. And I had the original back in 2018 when I had tried it. And I mean, it hurt like hell. It sticks on and I mean, it pulls out everything out of your pore. It just pulls. My complexion stayed beautiful for over a month. I don't know how long, but like my foundations, some of my foundations didn't even match no more because I had pulled so much dirt and just makeup and everything out of my pores. It was amazing. So I can't wait to try this because I've seen a lot of videos of different races, different people use this product and it looked absolutely amazing when you get done. And I think you have to do it like they recommend that you use it two to three times a week. I think that's, that's the instructions. I guess um, uh, you use that for a certain amount of time and then you can stop and then if you start to seeing your skin flare up again then you use it again I think I'm gonna look at the directions but I remember them saying two or three times a week on the website so we'll see we'll see y'all but I'm very excited about that um, I have on a brand new pair of leggings that I got from Shein.com, which I'm gonna show y'all on my Shella, or not Shella, this is Shella Beauty Essence, on my Shella Shemay channel. So look forward to that. Um, I have on new makeup. Uh, this is, this eyeshadow is actually from uh, the Instagram model makeup that sold at Walmart. Um, loving her eyeshadow palettes. This is also a lipstick. This one is in birthday suit. It is so pretty. And I have the one in um, the real nude one. It's very, very nude. Um, I forget the name of it, but it's very, very nude. And then there's one more I want to get. I'm going to try to get it. If they have it, it's uh, not the red one, but the, the deep it's like a deep red plum. I don't think it's plum. I think it's like a red purplish color. Like a deep tone. I think it'd be really pretty with the blonde hair and all. So I want that one. So, um, but I love this one in birthday suit because this is like a nude, but it's like a, it's like a coral nude though. It's not like the beigey nude or anything. It's like a beautiful coral color and normally I don't use it use coral lipsticks or wear coral much but I had to say okay with this palette the palette that I got is Miss um, Spice I use Miss Spice today and then I use the um, what did I say the lipstick is the lipstick is in birthday suit I put that on today and I absolutely love the combination it looks really pretty it looks perfect for this time of the year like spring going into summer it's a beautiful like natural makeup and then I used the LA colors um, blush stick stick and the highlighting stick I used on my face and then I use the uh, cab uh, contour palette by the Real Housewives of Atlanta Kim is her name she used to be on Real Housewives of Atlanta her and her daughter brand I use their contour palette and so it's basically what I have on foundation I use Ulta Beauty uh, liquid foundation I forget the name of a serum it's a serum um, by Ulta Beauty and then I mixed it with uh, what did I mix it with I had to mix it because it's a little what did I mix it with I mixed it with I think uh, L'Oreal Infallible 
uh, Pro Glow foundation. That's a little light. So I mixed the two together and it matched real good. So that's what I have on my face. I didn't set my face with powder. I want to, I'm in a hunt for a good powder because I got that Color Girl powder and I do not like it. Um, Y'all, it's just, it's supposed to be like that blurring effect. I don't like it. To me, it just kind of makes, cakes up my face. Um, and I do shave my face and I do keep my face clean. And I don't know what, why it cakes up on me. Every time I put it on, it just looks like it gets all into every little thing on my face. I don't know how to explain it. it you, you can see it up close. From a distance, you can't see it. But if you see, if you look like, when I look at myself in the mirror, I see it. And so if I get up on somebody or just talking to somebody, of course, they're going to see it. So I don't like that. I don't like anything that make make my skin cake up or look too thick or it gets into my fine lines like my dimple lines and stuff which that that is a problem that I'm just gonna have with any kind of foundation because I have dimples so foundation I always get in my dimples um, but I've been using the Physicians Formula Powder, and I do like it. I just don't like the fact that you have to, it's so hard to open. It's like powder gets everywhere. So I don't like that, That's, that causes a mess. And I just feel like I already got a banana shade at the house that I could use. So, I really don't have to have that Physicians Formula powder. So, what I'm doing today, you guys, is I'm returning uh, some shorts I'm going to take back. I did show one pair of these shorts on one of my videos, and I didn't like it. They were too, like my stomach, my lower part of my stomach is a little bit too big for these shorts. It made it look, it made the shorts look little. And they are because of my stomach, not because of my legs, but my stomach. So I didn't like the way that looked. So I'm taking that back. I kept the black pair. I kept the other light wash pair and I kept the uh, stone wash pair. So I did keep three pairs but I bought several pairs of shorts and uh, one's a lavender I haven't even worn yet. I just figure it's not gonna fit because the band, it doesn't have a stretch to it. And because of my stomach, you know, my stomach area is my problem area. It's the part of my body where it's like, yeah, that that's the part that causes everything to, be tight if I don't get the right size so go ahead <laughs> so y'all I am here to return these few things and then furthermore so I'm trying to find me a parking space here's one right here but I really didn't want to wait on it I don't want to be out in the road. Let me see if I can find one on down. I bet that was the closest one. That's, they're going to get it. <laughs> Y'all, I'm just like trying to get somewhere close, but it look like I'm going to have to walk all the way from down here. Uh, so, it's busy here all the time now. Every day. So y'all, I'm here. Let me go uh, turn these things in or return them and I'll come back, okay? All right. All right, you guys, I'm back. And I did exchange, I had to get, one thing had to be put on a cord, gift cord. Oh, I forgot about the scoops on. Oh my 
my goodness. Oh, it's not that time. That's right. Okay, y'all, that almost scared me. Um, I'm heading into another area. So I'm on the road traveling. And I just happen to come through the school area, but it's not that time for them to get out of school. It's only 11.58. But anyways, um, one of my things for some reason didn't scan up but it was on the ticket and uh so i had to get that put on a card so i got uh two now i got bedoya i think that's a name b-e-d-o-y-a i got a highlighter called malibu and i got uh the cab KB um, lip oil and lip liner. That's what I got. So I'm thinking I'm gonna like it. It's in the uh, the lip liner and lip oil is in Cherish. I show y'all everything, okay? That's probably all I'm gonna get. I'm not gonna get anything else. I don't think. I I just need to do some returns. Um, because what I have over here, I don't use it after buying it. It's just like wasted money if I don't go take it back to get my refund. So, yeah. Like I said, I kept three pairs of my shorts, but the other two pair I took back. And because one pair was too small. Um, like I said, for my stomach area. And then the other pair... I didn't know it had such a name as it did until I got in the store. And I said, no wonder why God kept telling me to take them shorts back. Uh, I didn't even know those shorts was called that name. Uh, so I took those shorts back and I'm glad I did. Um, but anyways, I'm heading over here and I thought I'd just talk to y'all for a little while. Now, I may not talk to you all the way over, but I'm going to talk to you for a little while. Just makes things a little bit quicker because I got to keep my eyes on the road. And so, yeah, I'll talk a little while. Uh, so, if you hear all that noise, yes, I'm, I'm around a lot of traffic right now. Um, so, <laughs> it's a beautiful day to travel. It's actually beautiful. It's not too hot. It's not too cool. It's just right. I'm thinking it's about 70 something degrees today because that's usually when it's really comfortable in my opinion 70 something degrees um it feels amazing well let me see what degree is it 67 degrees okay okay that's the windy part that i feel but it's still in the sun it feels warmer than that but it's 67 degrees okay <laughs> feels like it's in the 70 degree like at least 70 but it's not <laughs> so it's 67 degrees y'all and it's a beautiful day sunshiny day and i thought you know what i'm gonna ride over here and see they also have um, a certain kind of cosmetic that's very inexpensive i bought some things over there and yeah i like to get a different shade of the foundation because when I went over there the foundation I let y'all know what brand foundation was very low and then I like to get another eyeshadow palette um, I never get enough of eyeshadows no matter how many eyeshadows I get I never get enough just like bronzers I can buy a bunch of bronzers and I never get enough of bronzers um, I've gotten a good bit of foundations I feel like I need to slow down with foundations because I'm gonna, they're gonna expire and I'm not gonna use them all that much. So, yeah, <laughs> I think we slow down with the foundation a little bit. Um, but I'm gonna get another one of these foundations that is very inexpensive. It is a good foundation, very nice. The color that I got, just in my opinion, it just doesn't match completely. Um, so I'm gonna go to the next shade above that one, and that should work. So I think I got it in, I don't know what number of shade, uh, but I'm gonna try to 
get the next shade above, but that's about it. I'm not gonna get nothing else. That's it for me. Like, I'm just waiting on my orders to get here, my sheet in, and all of that, and a couple more things coming in, and that's it. I'm done for the, the month, it's for, unless I see a deal or something like that, but outside of that, that's it, the shopping. For this month, and I'm really concentrating on, I'm still wanting to move, y'all. It's just, I'm waiting on one person to come back into office, because I really prefer to stay, like, in the area, rather than, rather than, uh, I'm probably my window, because y'all may not even hear me that good. Okay, I'd rather stay in the area that I'm more familiar with than to actually, like, why is this car all on my bumper? Don't y'all just hate that? I'm going to slow down so they can go off. Like, they just right up on my bumper. Like, for real. Right up on my bumper. Like, stop. Pass me. Okay. Don't pass me. I can't stand that. Um, but yeah, you guys, uh, what was I saying? Keep my eyes on the road at all times. <laughs> um, I was talking about makeup, though. Like I said, I, yeah, shopping and stuff. I'm, you know, done with that for this month. I'm okay with the wigs that I got. I actually love this wig that I got because it's so cool and so it's going to be perfect for this warm weather. Even though I do prefer this wig to be about at least to my shoulder collarbone. Uh, I'm not used to wearing really short wigs. This is sort of short. It's short for me. Uh, but it's okay. It's not too bad. It's actually quite pretty. The waves and all that, that's, that's exactly what I like. Uh, so, it's okay. It's not too bad. But I will repurchase the wig that I originally ordered. This is not... This one is the correct wig, but the other wig that I got that was in that uh, Taylor Tuesday video, that is not the wig, y'all, that I ordered. Just saying, update on that. That's not the wig that I ordered. I ordered a lace front with 4.5 inch lace. That one do not have lace. It's a full wig. But it's all going to stop now because not only am I going to be tracking it, but some really good people are going to be tracking my packages. So they'll know exactly where my package is going to. So I've been suspicious. Oh, that's where the uh, Dollar General is. I remember one person was telling me to go come up here on the mountain and that they had a Dollar General. And I was wondering, I was like, where, what Dollar General are they talking about? It's right up here by the college. Okay. Well, now I know. Okay. But anyways, you guys. <clears throat> yeah, somebody switched wigs. And they just love to do that for some reason. I, I just hate. That's all I can say. Hate. Um, I wouldn't do nobody like that. I wouldn't steal nothing from nobody. Especially. Uh, I mean, come on. These hard times and stuff. Why are you going to do somebody like that? That's just completely wrong. And inconsiderate and mean. Like, I'm not even joking. That's just, like, crazy. I'll talk to y'all once I 
my destination as far as the store and then we'll talk then okay because we got a good bit of riding and i haven't drove like this in out of town in a while <laughs> last time i drove out of town uh was be before i got real sick with my eye so so i decided i'm gonna drive today and get back you know used to driving now this is not long long distance it's a distance but not too long okay i can't go long long distances but i can't i don't want to like I want to make sure that I still will get, I can still get in the car and go a little while of a distance and not let that that I experience hinder me from traveling if I have to travel a few miles. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right now, but I will be back to show you a few things that I did pick up. But it won't be a whole lot because I'm actually not going to buy any additional stuff. Uh, like I said, I'm just looking at maybe a foundation and one eyeshadow palette that I saw um, a while back that I did get. And that's it. And so um, I'll show y'all that. If they have that foundation shade. Uh, not, then I won't get no foundation uh, but I'm pretty sure that they'll have the eyeshadow they, the eyeshadows were packed out so yeah you guys I'm going to go ahead and end this vlog right now and I'll be back in a little while